with a look at our commodities. Here's Hayley Hobbs from Plum Grove. For the first time in a long while, Australian wheat is competitively priced into Southeast Asian markets. The recent fall in Australian wheat values, combined with a rally in global prices, has seen Aussie wheat start to re-engage traditional Indonesian and Philippine customers. In recent times, these customers had been increasingly favouring black sea wheat, which was far cheaper to import, even though they had to pay much more in freight to get it there. While this is of course excellent news for the Australian grain market, it does mean that prices have been rather stagnant this week, as we don't want to run away from demand. With nearly 20% of the feed barley crop already harvested, the spread between malt and feed barley prices is starting to widen. This is because the proportion of deliveries making malt barley specifications is unusually low.